Hey guys, welcome to Tuesdays on my channel, woo! So last week I started a new thing which is five things that dot 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 and last week's one was five things that annoy me whilst travelling so I thought I'd counteract that one and do five things that I love about travelling because I am a big fan of travelling and I don't want you to all think I just think of negative things so I'm really excited to do this one um, so let's begin I guess so number one is going to be the flying part, but not the middle part of the flying, the taking off and the landing part of flying, I love. Because when you take off, you have that force that like pushes you back. And I don't know why, but I really like that feeling. And then the second part is the landing bit, when, especially when there's a bit of a bumpy landing and you guys just basically go boom, 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 kind of thing. Like, I don't know why. I like it, I just do. I guess I find fa I find planes quite fascinating, like the science of how it's all working, because like, it's a big metal thing that's up in the sky with loads of people on it, like, the science of it, I will fascinate, and it's just like, I don't, I don't really know how I can explain it, like, I just love the, the pl plane taking off and landing, it's a really weird thing I know. But number two is going to get weirder. So, number two, and that is the holiday smell. Yeah, it sounds very weird, I know. Basically, when you go to like a hot country, I've seen, or when I go to a hot country, I've seen to notice that when you step off the plane, you first get hit with that heat. So it's like, you're like of all this heat. And then you get the smell. And the smell is like a mix, it's just a holiday smell. It's all I can really describe. It's like the smell of the sun, the smell of beaches, the smell of um, suntan lotion. It's just that smell. And I always associate it now with holidays. Like I can remember the first time, like I went to Spain or something, I think it was Spain last year, and I got off the plane, I was like, why is the smell? Because whenever I've gone to a hot place, like Africa, um, Mallorca, Majorca, whenever I've gone to like a hot country, I've always stepped off that plane and got that smell. And I associate it with hot holidays now. And I really do love that smell. Like, I miss it. I haven't really had that hot, be the hot smell since but two years now so I'm quite looking forward to my really hot holiday to Jamaica at Christmas because I'm hoping that I'll step off that plane and get that really nice holiday smell it's really weird but I love it so that's number two um number three that's a really weird three three is the destination knowing the f I like I love the fact that I when I'm going on holiday that I know I'm going to somewhere different and I'm away from where I live and I'm away from England like I love it and it's just you you well, you always you pick a place you want to see and you want to visit so knowing that you're going to be getting all these new experiences at this new destination I just love it like I love I don't really know what else to say really it's just the fact that knowing that I'm in a new place and I'm away from England is like the best feeling ever so the destination um, hmm, this is hard. Number four, learning new cultures. Like, I know there's so many different cultures out there and I probably will never get to experience and learn about them all. But it's just so amazing to meet new people and learn about their culture, meet, learn about all the different foods that they eat, their religions, the habits like certain people don't shake with your don't shake with your right hand or your, like certain countries that because of the fact right hands that you use to wipe so shake with your left and just all that kind of stuff stuff and like seeing just how people live like with very little and yet I'm obviously one of those people that like to have lots of stuff and then go into like a different country where they don't have that much stuff and yet they're so happy, it's just amazing. So learning about different cult different cultures and how they deal with things, it's just an amazing part of travelling. Like I really do love it. And finally, number five is the adventure. Knowing the fact that well, really, from the start of leaving your home, you're taking a little bit like you got a little risk. You gotta get to the airport. Airports are a bit of a risk nowadays. You gotta go through security. You get on the plane, and obviously it's plane crashing, so you have all that. Then you get on holiday, and you're gonna meet new people. You're gonna get new experiences, try new food, maybe go on zip line, lining, or whatever trips have got off up to offer. Go up and volcanoes, have clouds go past you, face your fears, and go scuba diving. Whatever there is, holidays and travelling gives you that opportunity to have such an adventure and to 
just experience life in a different way. Like I love it. Like I'm, I love adventure. It's um, amazing. So there you go. That's my five things I love about travel. I um, hope you liked them and I hope you didn't think some of them were weird and I hope you agreed with some of them as well. If there's five things that you like about travelling, let me know in the comments below. And if there's five things that you want me to talk about, also let me know in the comments below because I'm hoping to keep doing this on Tuesdays for quite some time because I'm really enjoying making these videos. So that's everything. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I do put up videos four times a week. I have Mondays, Challenge Mondays, where, I, where myself or me and my sister will do, some, do a challenge. Tuesdays are five things that dot dot dot. Fridays are random ones, so it's unboxings or whatever I can think of. However, if I can't think of something on the fr to do for a Friday video, there will not be one because I don't want to put out really terrible content. And then Sundays is Gaming Sundays, where currently I'm playing Until Dawn with my sister. And it's an amazing game. So that is everything. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on everything. And I think that's everything. So thank you so much for watching. And I hope you're having a great morning, afternoon, evening, whatever the time of day. So I hope you're happy and smiling, because that's the most important thing. And I shall see you all in my next video. Goodbye.